Hello everybody, welcome to our e-learning sessions for second prep, module 9, better safe than sorry. Better safe than sorry. Slide number 2, prevention is better than cure. Number 3, the search for the secret of a long and healthy life is not a new, a new one. Though we may never find the mythical fountain of youth that can make all your, our disease disappear. We are closer to understanding our bodies and what makes them th thick. Thick. Um, we now know that health and vitality can be found in an elixir, but in the choices we make in life. To get the fountain of youth flowing within yourself, you can start um, by exercising or maybe taking up a sport. The British Journal of Sport Medicine states that if you stay physically fit, you can delay the aging process by 10 years. Exercise not only helps with weight loss, but also helps preventing high blood pressure, helps fit, um, fight heart diseases and type 2 diabetes, certain types of cancers. Uh, arthritis and other elements related to blood circulation. The next slide. Another benefit of sports and exercises is their ability to boost your mood. Joy not only improves the quality of our life, but also increases our desire to live. A great deal of research by the Journal of Happiness Studies proves that if you are happy and satisfied in your life or with your life, then you are more likely to enjoy good health. The next slide. If you are physically fit and happy, you will enjoy a healthier life with few illness. Much like the people of Okinawa, Okinawa in Japan, where people live longer than anywhere else in the world, Okinawa's, Okinawa's themselves state that their stress-free lives and active lifestyle are the reasons. However, there might be more too in that in than that. After all, Okinawa's else also take care of their diet by consuming sweet potatoes and foods that are high in vitamin A and beta carotene. Beta carotene. The next slide. If you slap piles of butter on your bread, eat fatty foods and are a smoker, you will not enjoy good health, regardless of the amount of exercise or joy in your, in your life. Back in the 70s, especially in the region of Northern Karelia, learned with this the, the hard way with their hearts and lungs paying the price of bad eating habits. Their country held the world record for heart diseases until the Finnish Health Department decided that um, it was time for people to change their unhealthy lifestyle there. The next slide. In Northern Karelia, the average 20 years old had only consumed vegetables in hand full of times in their life. The, author the authorities knew that if people made healthier food choices, they would see the death rate in their country decrease. If healthier food choices became easier to make, then the situation would change. Con uh, consequently, the only way to change the situation was to change society itself. Next slide. That's why the government got everybody involved in its project health centers, supermarkets, schools, office cafe, cafeterias, housewives, farmers, town competed against each other in cholesterol lowering competitions for prizes such as a bike path, a new walkway, healthy eating events became popular while TV reality shows focused on people's weight loss. The fitness realized that making the right choices was anything but boring. 
Soon farmers responded by returning to fine lands, forgotten forest traditions of growing berries. Heart diseases dropped by 80% and fine land was well on its way to becoming the, health, the healthy no nation we know today. Next slide. There are many little things we can do every day to ensure that we have better health. Things like brushing our teeth, taking the time to wash our hands from germs before we eat, getting uh, adequate sleep, doing crossword puzzles to keep our minds sharp, choosing to love in a greener area, to, to live, sorry, to live in a greener area and avoiding dangerous chemicals when we clean our houses. All oh, that is needed for careful thinking and taking precautions. Each country and each person may have different health. However, there is one thing that we all know is painfully true. Prevention is better than cure. In the next slide. Here we have, we have some new vocabulary. Let's see together. Adequate means enough or satisfactory for a particular purpose and it's an adjective the word age if someone ages or something ages them they look older element means an illness Arthr arthritis means a serious condition in which person joints joints means the places where two bones are connected together became painful swollen or stiff. Blood pressure, a measure of the pressure at which the blood flows through the body. Boost, to improve or increase something. Cancer, a serious disease that is caused when cells in the body grow in a way that is uncontrolled and not normal. Killing normal cells and often causing death. Cholesterol, a substance containing a lot of fat that is found in the body tissue and blood of all animals and which is thought to be part of the cause of heart disease if there is too much to, of it. Circulation, when something such as information, money or goods passes from one person to another. In slide number 12, consume. Consume means to use fuel or energy or time, especially in a large amount. Crossword, a game in which you write words which are the answers to questions in a pattern of black and white squares. Death rate, the speed at which death happens. Deportment, a part of an organization such as a school, business or government, which deals with a particular area of study or work. Desire. A strong feeling that you want something. The next slide. Diabetes. Diabetes is a disease in which the body cannot control the level of sugar in our blood. Fatty food. The food containing a lot of fat. Flow. Especially for liquids, gases or electricity. That means to move in one direction, especially continu continuously and easily. Germ. Germ is a very smaller organism that causes diseases. Handful. Handful means a small number of people or things. The next slide. Housewife. Housewife is the woman whose work is inside her house, doing the cleaning, cooking, and so on, and who usually doesn't have any other job. Illness. A disease of the body or mind. Lung. Either of the two organs in the chest with which people and some animals breathe. Most of animals actually. The nation. Nation is a country, especially when thought of as large group of people living in one area with their own government, language, traditions and so on. Fit. Fit means to be the right size or shape for someone or something. The next slide. Physically. Physically means in a way that relates to the body or someone's appearance. Pile, objects positioned on one on top of another, one over another. 
precaution. Precaution is an action which is done to prevent something unpleasant or dangerous from happening. Vitality. Vitality means energy and strength. The word additive. Additive means a substance which is added to food in order to improve its taste or appearance or to preserve it. Balanced diet, a combination of the correct types of amounts of food. The next slide, bone. Bone is any of the hard parts of inside the human or animal that makes up its frame, its shape. Diary, diary used to refer to cow, dairy, sorry, I'm sorry, dairy, used to refer to cows that are used for producing milk rather than meat or to foods which are made from milk, such as cream, butter, cheese, ice cream, anything related, yogurt, anything related with milk. A dietitian is a person who scientifically studies and gives advices about food and eating. Carbohydrates, one of several substances such as sugar or starch, which provide the body with energy or foods containing these substances such as bread, potato, pasta, rice, and so on. Crash diet. Crash diet is a way of losing body weight quickly by eating very little. The next slide. Slide number 17. Digest digestion. When your body digests food or your ability to digest food to remove or to change the food from its shape to the shape that is uh, useful for your body. Fat, the substance under the skin of humans and animals that stores energy and keeps them warm. Fiber, a substance in food such as fruits, vegetables and brown bread which travels through the body as waste and helps the contents of the bowels to pass through the body easily. The next slide. Items with the word touch. High in something. Having something in great amount. Learn something the hard way. To face troubles before learning a lesson. Pay the price. To suffer uh, the consequence. Prevention is better than cure. To prevent a disease is better than curing it. Is better than curing it. What makes somebody or something tick? How somebody or something functions or behaves. The next slide. Words with the word with the suffix this. Disconnect. That means to unfasten something, especially to break the connection between a supply of electricity, gas, water, and a device or a piece of equipment. Disapprove means to feel that something or someone is bad or wrong. Not to, imp not to approve or agree. Disobey, to refuse doing something that you are told to do it or not to obey. Displease, to cause someone to be annoyed or unhappy. Disrespect, that means lack of respect. Slide number 20, words with miss. Misbehavior, to behave badly or to behave in a wrong way. Misdeal. Sorry, misdial. Misdial means to dial the wrong number. Mishear, to fail to hear someone's word correctly or in the way that was intended and to think that someone, something different was said. Misinform, to tell someone information that is not correct. Misjudge, to form an opinion or, or idea about someone or something which is unfair or wrong. The next slide. Mislead. To cause someone to believe something that is not true. Misplace. To lose something temporarily for forget, by forgetting where you have put it. Mispronounce. 
to pronounce a word or a sound wrongly in a in the wrong way, misread, to make a mistake in the way that you read something, misspell, to fail to spell a word correctly, misunderstand, to think you have understood someone or something when you have not. The next slide, Phrase, phrases with come, come around, come around means to visit someone in their home, come back means to return to a place, come down with means to start to suffer from an illness, especially one that is not serious, come into, if someone comes into money, property or a title, they receive it as a result of the death of relation. Come out, if a book, record, film, or so on, comes out, it becomes available for people to buy or see them. The next slide, phrases with come. Come to somebody, if something comes back to you, you start to remember it. Come up, to move towards someone. Come up against, to have to deal with, with a problem. Come up with, to suggest or think of an idea or a plan. The next slide, phrases with go, go ahead, to start to do something, go along with, to support an idea or to agree with someone's opinion, go back means to return, go by, to move past in space or time, go off, if a light or a machine goes, goes off, it stops working. Go over, to examine or look at something in a careful or detailed way. Go through, to experience a difficult or unpleasant situation. Go with, if one, um, if one thing goes with another, they suit each other, or they look or taste good together. The next slide. Okay, here we have some questions to be sure that you understood. Number one, we don't use any in our food. The color is natural. Philly food, calcium additives, mattress additives. Thank you. Number two, good and regular berries are especially for a long and healthy life. Nutrient, nutrition. Thank you. Dora won't be there tonight. She, ca she come with a bad cold. Calm down. Thank you very much. We have finished our session for today. See you soon.